there'll never be a day where you won't remember it or feel something missing from your heart. An unspeakable tragedy brought the Virginia community together last November. United in their grief, heartbreak, and collective prayer. They came to mourn Devin Chandler, Lavelle Davis Jr., and Deshaun Perry, shot and killed after returning home from a class field trip. They came to pray for those who were shot and injured, including running back Mike Hollins, who was in critical condition. Hollins would survive, and the long road to recovery would begin. Within months, he surprised even his doctors with how much progress he had made. Mike Hollins was determined to play football again. I just feel like enough was already taken from me, so I just wasn't gonna let football be, you know, taken from me as well. Through the tears, through the struggles, you know, he's shown up, right, and he's been there for his teammates. There's something bigger than him that he's working towards. With more motivation than ever before, Hollins returned to practice in March. A month later, he delivered a resounding moment in the spring game. Hollins with the carry! Touchdown, Virginia! And his little brother comes storming in. He wants to celebrate with Mike Hollins. It was special. It was a moment I, I never thought I would experience again. Just having my team there, my little brother there in the end zone, it meant the world to me. Just knowing how powerful the game could be in helping me to move forward. He's really a superhero, man. He really is our leading way in our lighthouse, you know, showing us where we need to go and how we're going to get there. Hollins will be there again on the field as Virginia opens the season against Tennessee today. The Cavaliers' first game back since the tragedy last fall. Nobody at Virginia will ever move on from what happened, but they will move forward with their heads held high and their hearts full, playing for Lavelle, Devin, and Deshaun. As long as we go out there and play, we're doing their legacy justice, because we're here, and I believe that it's enough for them. <laughs>